Hello, people of the internet, and welcome to this first, maybe, first episode in Spelunky. This is one I've wanted to play for a while now. It uh, came out like three or four years ago, um, and I ended up getting it for Steam, <clears throat> and I was going to play it on Steam uh, sometime. But uh, with my computer not being able to play Steam games very well, luckily this month Xbox released it for free. So I decided we'll play it on the console, and that would make things probably a little bit better for me as far as my setup goes. But So yes, hello if you're watching here live on Twitch. Thank you for stopping by. And if you're watching After the Fact over on YouTube, thank you for checking out the video here. Um, so yeah, we'll play this for a few hours tonight. I don't know if it'll be a regular thing. I kind of want to get back to like the indie nights. Like, we used to do Wednesday night would be uh, like an indie night. Uh, we would do like Binding of Isaac a lot and a few other things. So maybe that's what we'll do with um, with Wednesdays. We'll make them be like an indie night. So so tonight's going to be Spelunky. Uh, we'll kind of get right to it then. I've just got something in my eye. Forgive me here. I don't know what it is. But yes, we'll get right to it here. Uh, I've played a little bit of it, and I've done the tutorial stuff before, and I think maybe the first level, um, but it's been like a year or two since I've done that. But anyways, so we'll go ahead. Let me turn this all up here. We'll go ahead and take any music on out. This is any music. Check them out at animusic.com or over on any music on. I always want to say Facebook on YouTube. Check them out at any music there. So we'll go ahead and we'll bring this all back up here. I didn't get a chance to test it fully with the sound, so hopefully. It, uh, hopefully it sounds all right. I guess I could actually test it here. I don't know why I didn't do this before. But we'll get right to it here. I think there was a little bit of an opening, um, story-wise kind of in the beginning there, but it was just him walking into this temple, so. Let's see what it has for us. <clears throat> First off, we'll go through the, uh, settings here real quick. And we'll do options here. Make sure everything is unused, unused, move, run, purchase, slash door, rope, bomb, jump. Okay, that's all stuff we learned. Sound effects, music, brightness. Well, let me turn up the brightness a little bit. Yeah, that'll be alright. Damsel style. I guess we can have it be all three. We can I guess we can do all three, I guess. I don't know. <laughs> I kinda of forget. Credits, okay, we'll get right out of here then. Downloadable. Download content. Uh, there's downloadable content. That'd be kind of cool. <clears throat> All right, cool. So let's go right to it. Play game. Um, no, because I'm not. I don't have Xbox Live on this username. So. I play game. I can't. Oh, I guess. I guess you have to enable it for Xbox Live. Okay. <clears throat> Choose Adventurer. We get the main dude, and then we've got a bunch of other characters we can choose from. That's cool. And these are locked. Okay, so we'll just be the main dude. I don't know if he has an actual name, but we'll be the main dude. And yep, here we go. I'm gonna listen here too. All right, I guess that sounds okay. <clears throat> and there we are. We are in... Oops, sorry. We are in the world of Spelunky. Whip. And those don't do anything. I can duck. And you can duck and crawl, that's right. And then holding the right trigger makes you run and jump. And I can pick up... You can pick that up by pushing down. And I can throw it. But pushing down an X picks up an item. Okay. <clears throat> You picked up a journal. Press back to open it up. Looks like Wolverine got a hold of it there, too. Greetings, my name is Yang. And this is my journal. Dusty maps and rumors of amazing treasures here have led me here. Deep. Under the desert. There's something very strange about this place. The layout seems to change all the time. Yeah, this is a like a procedurally generated game, I think. The levels are different every time, except for, I think, the tutorial. Um... But I think the levels are different every time you play it, so that's kind of cool. I've never seen the same room twice, exactly. Olmec. Uh, it could be the legendary curse of Olmec, so it is an Olmec. 
Uh, the one they say traps people inside the caves forever. I push the idea out of my mind to focus on the treasure instead. If I master the basics of movements and combat, I know I'll leave here a rich man. <clears throat> so here we go. Wow, this seems a little bit louder. Let's go ahead and turn that down just a smidge. Make sure that's all right. All right, so we got the basics we're gonna learn here. Basic movements, jumping. Jump, whip, here we go, so there's A. And then jump to get up, and you clip that. And you can jump on those guys, yes. And those are all 1,000 or 500 each, jump over there. Okay, so it's all pretty easy to figure then. But we'll just get right through the, ooh. It's money. Uh, it's one of these collecting games, so I'm gonna want to collect everything. Wow, the controls are actually really nice. I forgot how I forgot how nice and fluent they are. Yeah, it's all just second nature to me right now. It seems nice. All right, so that's all good. <clears throat> oh no I guess if you fall from too high you die did I die I think I did I think I ended up falling from too high oops anyways all the golden I know you can use bombs to blow up the rocks and stuff so that's something we can oh wow perfect timing I know that's something you can do as well How do I get the gold uh, gem over there? Oh, isn't it, um, you can just walk? If you jump on top of it, you get hurt, but if you walk, you can go across it. That's right, I do remember that. Uh, seeing a, another, uh, playthrough of it. And that's it. Cool. Easy enough. So yeah, so this will just be something we play tonight. I don't know if it's something we'll normally regularly do or finish at all, but... It's uh, definitely going to be something that that we play. The journey has been more difficult than I expected. I've fallen into spike pits, stepped into traps, and been attacked by monsters. Yet, no matter what happens, I always wake up at the entrance to the mines. It's like death itself has lost its way down here. Despite the eeriness uh, of these events, I remain focused on the task at hand. Eagerly, I press on, pursuing my fame and fortune. So we got more with tutorial 2. Now we're going to learn about the whip. Okay, easy enough. Now we have bombs. Nice. Now we got some gems. Can I get over there? Nice. Journal entry added. <clears throat> Monsters. Kills one, killed by zero. So this is going to keep track of everything we do. There's 56 different monsters. That's cool. Down in B throws the bomb short range, I think. And Y. Okay, so if I want short... Oh, that's cool. If I hold the direction, it moves. Okay, so down in B just kind of tosses it out. I think B actually throws it. We're going to try this here. Yeah, B actually throws it. Oh, you can blow up the wood. Okay. Good to know. Now we've got rope. We have six rope. Throw it up there. Very nice. Yeah, so this is going to be easy. So we can just kind of jet through all this stuff. Maybe. <laughs> oh, shoot. Oh, and I can't get back up there. Crap. Get, no, okay, so I've got to... Oh, crap, it didn't throw it far enough. Oh, crap. I wanted to blow that area over there so I can get the stuff over there. Ah, well. Run and jump, okay. 
and you just run across those. Very cool. Yeah, so I missed out some of the treasure, but oh well. Let's just go. <clears throat> I caught a glimpse of a lush paradise on the other day, at the end of the mines. How could such a place exist so far underground, and what lies beyond? Cave merchants speak of even more fabulous sites, features below, sites further below, ancient ruins and cities made of gold. The uh, the very idea makes me restless. Ah, the very idea makes my restless heart beat faster. I'm just trying to move some stuff around here as well. Sorry. Yeah, I should have just muted the mic in the first place. Two bombs, five ropes. Oh, that sucks. A journal entry added. Places. Okay, ten places. But what journal entry was added? Monsters. Oh, no. Oh, traps. Oh, okay. Here we go. So it doesn't keep track of my getting killed by those. It says zero item. What's up, Pepe? We got items found. How many different items are there? Are there 34 different items? Holy cow. There's going to be a lot to this then. Down an X picks up an item. X throws it then. Okay. Ooh, double. Oh, I saw this game in a YouTube channel. Yeah, it's a little, uh, it's a couple years old. But um, I've wanted to play it for a long time. Uh, I've played very little of it um, because I had it on Steam. Um, oh, you can get hit by the rock. Uh, I have it on Steam, but my computer can't play Steam games very well and stream at the same time. But it happens to be one of the free games that Microsoft is giving away. Um, so I decided to go ahead and why not? So, did you have nightmares with the penguin you killed? No, I didn't. Bomb bag, bomb bag, bomb bag, bomb bag. Oh no! What? Because I attacked him on accident? What the heck? Alright, so at least we start the level over. Ah, oh, jeez. That sucks. I didn't mean to actually hurt him. running around. I should be careful where I'm running. So, <clears throat> press RB to purchase. Oh, geez. There we go. So if I want to drop down there, I can... Well, I can push this. Right? Yeah, I can push this out of the way. I don't have to worry about bombing anything. Nice. Oh, nice. There's the... Uh... Can I pick her up? Isn't, aren't I supposed to be able to pick up the dame to bring her back? Because we chose the dame as being uh, the guy, the dog, or the girl. But no, I did not have any nightmares over that. Because I didn't kill it. Ooh. Journal entry added. Idol, a golden statue guarded by deadly traps. Bring it to the exit for a big reward. Nice. So wait, what's the big... Oh, nice. So what's the big... How do I get out of here? I guess I could probably just throw a bomb down, right? Oh, I didn't mean to do that. You gotta remember, B is bomb. Okay. Oh no! I didn't mean to throw it that far. Crap, now I can't take it to the exit. Oh well. A lot of little things you gotta remember. Oh, I, I can bring the dame back, can I? Let me go back and get the dame. Oh, I can't get the dame now either. Crap. Oh, well, this is just a tutorial, so we're fine. Um, I do want to do this, though. 
Ah, crap, seriously? There we go. Nice. I can't get to the exit now? <sighs> really? I could use a rope for that? Crap. <sighs> to whom holds this journal, I hope you find it useful. It served me well, but I no longer need it. I'm... I'm decided... I'm decided... Oh, I'm descending into the caves for what I hope is the last time. I won't return until I've escaped the ultimate treasure. Or... Are there even greater delights to be discovered? Well, there's only one way to find out. Take this key, which is just in the book. Take this key, it will open the entrance to the mines. Follow me if you dare. Happy exploring, gang. Okay, so maybe I haven't done this. I don't remember going through the door. Cool. Achievement unlocked, so it begins. Penguin, you killed. Yeah, so maybe I did. I don't remember this, so maybe I did just do the tutorial. The walls are shifting. And off we go. It's mines 1-1. One, one. Journal entry added. A living skeleton straight out of your nightmares. Give me all the goodies. Oh, there's nothing really over there. I mean, I'll probably use bombs and stuff to blow some stuff up, but I kind of want to conserve a little bit. We're going to have a bunch of monies, though. If I keep running into stuff like this. do need to use the bomb, though, for that. I need to get across. I need to get down there. Take a shot every time Kenor kills a penguin. That could be interesting. I can't get over there now because I just blew up that. I wonder after I lay down a bomb, can I pick it up again then? I wonder. There's the dame. Ow. Can I pick? Oh, I can't pick up his head. Oh, uh, maybe it did disconnect. I don't know. If it disconnected, that really sucks. Larger than your average household variety, don't let it get the drop on you. Ooh, nice. It looks like it may have, because it looks like we just dropped a bunch of... Looks like I dropped a bunch of frames, so it may have uh, disconnected. If so, then I am sorry. At least there's no time limit. That's nice. No, I don't think it. I don't think it disconnected. Oh, I do have to give a shout out. We had a follow here today. Um, in between our streams here, so I have to give a shout out. They're up up there on our most recent one, but uh, Double X Vavato Vavatso Double X. Thank you for the follow. Double thumbs up. You are awesome. Oh, it is you. Okay. All right. So we've got. Oh no. I hit B. Yang was right. The layout of the caves is changing all the time. I just blew up money time damsel so wait so does that mean it totally like how many lives do i have what so the mines one one are all different again and and so i mean now we don't have any now we're starting fresh again so all right, so we do have to be real careful with what we do here. So mine's 1-1, one, one, totally reloaded, totally different map. Let's do this. Green Fury just has a big delay. Oh, uh, okay. That may be me. The delay may also be me as well, so... Yeah, it may just be something on 
in my end. Oh, that's a... That's something that hurts me. Oh, shoot. Okay, I gotta be careful of that. Well, we had a good amount of money and stuff, but oh well. Wait, there's a pot up there. One minute delay. Wow. You're right. There is a really big delay. I'm looking at it right now, and uh, I'm way behind. Well, you know what? Um, seeing as we just started, that seems to be like good enough for one segment. I'm gonna just do a restart on my internet on the stream here, real quick. So uh, I'll just do a quick restart. Maybe that'll help it out. So I'll be right back. <laughs> 